Greetings everyone, I hope you're doing great and are taking good care of yourselves. Today I'm going to be talking about how you can easily create a fast API project thanks to the fast API new package. Now the fast API new package is a package that the fast API team has created to make it easy for us to bootstrap or to start fresh fast API projects. So as long as you have UV, you can access the uvx command, which helps you directly run commands that come from Python packages. So you don't need to install that package, but all you need is to run uvx and then the command that comes from that package. For example, if I want to start a new FastAPI project, I can just say uvx FastAPI new, and then specify the folder of where I want my project to be created. So if I press enter, we shall see creating new fast API project, setting up environment with UV, it will go ahead and install some dependencies, write template files, and then give us a success message. It will also give us access to the next steps and how to deploy our simple application using the fast API cloud. So let's have a look at what comes inside there. If I went to code dot or <laughs> open up my VS code inside that folder, I think I opened it up in the home folder. Let me close this and go to the to-dos directory. Now I can see um, that this is our project. So one thing that we notice here is we have just a freshly created UV project that has a virtual environment, a main.py file, a pyproject.tomo file, a readme.md file and a uv lock. Now the most important thing is our main.py and this is where our app instance is created. We also have a root endpoint with a simple response that returns a message of hello world. And then we can also see that FastAPI standard has already been installed. So we have access to the FastAPI CLI as well as all the other tools that come within the FastAPI standard installation. Now let us try to run our server. If I go down to my terminal right here, I can do uv run, and then I can run the FastAPI CLI command to run our server in development with uv run FastAPI dev. So just like that, we see that our server is running. We can also access a browser on our local host 8000. And just like that, we see that our server is running, which is amazing. One of the other things is a readme.md file. And all this does is to just basically give us some of the items that were already shown to us when creating our project. It contains a description of the project, how to start and run a development server, and also instructions on how to deploy our app to the fast API cloud. We have the project structure containing the files. So we have main.py and pyproject.tomo. And those are the only files we have in here. So this is just a very interesting way, a very simple way in which you can get up and running with your first API project without having to configure everything from scratch, which I think is a very good idea. Thank you guys for watching. I'm going to be making such short videos, but I'll be making long form fast api content and i'm really glad that you guys are watching my fast api content so yeah see you in the next video bye